Assalam o Alaikum guys. I hope you all will be fine. Today in this video lecture I will guide you for depth of footing for five floors residential building. Most of the students they are asking about size of footing, depth of footing, inside steel reinforcement for two story, three story, four story, five story residential building. Remember guys this is not easy to say that the size of the footing for two story should be one by one meter or 1.5 by 1.5 meter and the depth should be two meter. This is not easy because we have many factors. From that factors we can take decision and we can uh, we can select the size of footing, we can select the uh, size of column, depth of footing etc. So let's get started guys to guide you for depth of footing. Remember guys if you are going for more than two story and if you want to build your house if that is residential building so you should hire the structural engineer if you are going more than two story that's why because if you take decision for size of footing depth of footing from your personal experience because so this is wrong that's why because you don't know the bearing capacity of soil you don't know that what should be the spacing between two column etc so therefore structural engineer is very important to decide the size of footing or different rcc structure they will give you its design okay so remember to take the size of footing remember one thing so we have many factors the first one is very important that is structure load what is your structure load for five story building if you take decision that the size of the footing should be for example this is rcc footing if you say the size is 1.5 meter by 1.5 meter so from here you will get this video so therefore i'm telling you we have many factors so the first one is structure load so for five story g plus four uh, g plus 4 that is 5 stories so how you will know what is your structure load so structure load calculation is very important and this is not easy to say okay next one next one is guys bearing capacity of soil bearing capacity of soil okay this is also important that where you want to build your house so you should check the bearing capacity of soil and that is the job of structural engineer so from bearing capacity of soil they will know that this is the structure load and this is the bearing capacity of soil they will do the proper calculation they will give you the size of footing and depth of footing etc next one is guys that is spacing of column okay so if the spacing is maximum so we will increase the size of footing we will increase the depth of footing so if you don't know the spacing of column so before before finishing architectural design okay so you are not able to decide the structural drawing so therefore you should know about the spacing of column sometimes we have maximum spacing sometimes we have minimum spacing so you cannot take decision by yourself or from your personal experience okay next one is guys grade of concrete what grade of concrete do you use okay grade of concrete for residential building the other one is grade of steel okay so these all things are very important before starting take decision of size of uh, footing and its depth etc but for example if you are going up to three story or four story from three to two story from three to four story if you are going and you don't know about these things so first of all bearing capacity is very important as i told you before the next one is also the structure load spacing of column grade of concrete grade of steel so if you don't know but you are you want to build your house so i'm telling you by thumb rule okay by thumb rule remember one thing guys by thumb rule okay by thumb rules so from four to three story the depth of footing you can keep from 1.5 to 2 meter okay so this is the depth of footing okay this is for three to three to four story four story building but residential building not commercial building 
That's why because we will put the factor of safety. If you see guys, 2 meter depth of footing is very large. This is very high depth of footing. That's why because we don't know, therefore we will put the factor of safety. So if you don't know all these things, so how you will take decision? So therefore we will put the factor of safety. We will increase. But sometimes when you increase the depth of footing, so you will also going to the failure side. That's why because we have different layers in soil and some layers are weak, some layers are strong. So therefore I'm telling you bearing capacity taken is very important for residential building or commercial building to take decision of uh, size of column and size of beam, size of anything, size of footing, etc. Okay. So for example, if you don't know what is grade of concrete, for example, I'm using M20 grade. Okay. M20 grade, which ratio is 1 ratio 1.5 ratio 3. Okay. So this is M20. If you are using M15, so that is not the better from this one. Okay. So therefore, I'm telling you, if you are using the uh, sorry, this is grade of steel. So for example, if you are using 40 grade, okay, and we have 60 also, if you are using M20, which ratio I already I discussed 1.5 and 3. If the spacing is more than 16 feet. Okay, so for that we will also uh, take the uh, size of column, we will increase. That's why because 16 is not normal. Okay, from 14 to 15, you can keep the spacing of residential building. So when you take decision of size of footing, then you will take decision of size of column. That's why because if you are using the size smaller for our CC column, that is also very dangerous. That's why because if the footing is strong and the column is not strong, also the column is going to the failure side. Okay. Next guys, bearing capacity. We have different types of soil and different types of soil has different bearing capacity. So therefore, if you don't know about these things, you cannot take decision. So this is the job of structure, uh, structural engineer to give you the structural drawing for uh, foundation, beam, column, slab, inside steel reinforcement, etc. If that is two story, three story, four story, etc. Thanks for watching. See you in next video. Goodbye.